Turning our attention now to the ASX, here's Matt Burney and Bulls and Bears with the latest public company views and interviews. Welcome to Bulls and Bears, where we break down the latest ASX announcements from public companies doing interesting things. Today's Bulls and Bears report is brought to you by Comet Ridge, ASX code COI. I'm Matt Burney and I'm joined now on 6PR by the Managing Director of Comet Ridge, Tor McCall. Hi, Tor. Hi, Matt. How are you? Good. Comet Ridge is an emerging natural gas developer with a portfolio of gas projects in Queensland and New South Wales. Its flagship asset is its 40% owned gas-rich Mahalo coal seam gas project in Queensland that it owns in partnership with two of Australia's gas giants, Australian Pacific LNG and Santos. Interestingly, Comet Ridge has been quietly amassing an armoury of prospective ground for itself around the Mahalo joint venture. Tor, I see recently you picked up even more ground around that Mahalo joint venture. How much ground do you have now and what's the strategy there? We were lucky this week. We've announced we've won two more blocks from the Queensland Government. The Queensland Government competitively bids these. We had a win late last year on a 100% block right beside Mahalo and we've had another two wins this week. So we've now got three 100% blocks around our big JV block with our joint venture partners. It's becoming a real gas hub. We're quite excited about it. We were only 240 k's west of Gladstone, so it's in the right address. We're building a big position and we're looking to move forward on it as quickly as we can. Okay, so the Mahalo JV is just to the south of your new land. What's the resource down there at Mahalo and how close is it to production? We've got reserves and resources booked on Mahalo. Our gross reserve basis, so across the joint venture, puts it at about 450 petajoules which is getting close to about half a TCF. And as we go forward and develop, we hope, obviously, we get that plus a little bit more as the contingent resources move across the reserves category. So there's quite a bit of gas there in the joint venture block. We're also now doing some analysis on the, these new blocks to bring that gas in as well. What does a petajoule of gas sell for these days? East and West Coast markets are a little different. What price a petajoule of gas is worth about 3 or $4 million. On, on a term basis, if you were selling long term, it would be something more like a about $8 million. We see the gas prices, the spot market tightening here over the next year or two. So we think we'll see firmer gas prices here uh, going forward. What are the chances that the gas reservoir on the Mahalo joint venture to the south of your new ground actually extends onto your new 100% owned ground? Exceptionally high. We've got a lot of seismic and drilling data, which shows that the new blocks, the new block on the west side and the new blocks on the east side contain that uh, high quality gas fairway. So we're expecting to develop the new blocks with the same sort of style horizontal wells that we'll be using for the for the main block. Tor McCall from Comet Ridge, thanks very much for joining me on 6PR today. And just remember, Bulls and Bears is only here to give you information, not advice, which you should, of course, seek independently. I'm Matt Burney. Thanks for listening to Bulls and Bears. For more public company CEO interviews, go to the money page at 6PR.com.au and click the public companies tab.